Say hello to my little friend! Alright, survivors, welcome back to Unturned 3 Early Access. Today's, uh, what is today? <laughs> August 8th, it's Monday. <laughs> wow, yeah, coffee's still kicking in here, guys. Sorry. Uh, we have a new update. August 5th is when it came out last Friday. So, yeah, it's a few days. I'm sorry, I'm late again, as usual. But you know what they say, better Nate than Lever, right? And we actually have Nate Lever, Officer Nate Lever, down here waiting in the wings to uh, show us. Wait a minute. Nate, what are you doing here? You don't know anything about these new weapons. we got a whole new weapon shipment in. Uh, shipment number... It's two of two, and Nate, you don't know anything about these. Let's go get Smack. Where's Sergeant Smack? Nate, go get Sergeant Smack, you ding-dong. There he is. That's the guy we want. Sergeant Smack. He's down in Canada right now waiting to show you guys the new weapons. So let's get down there. We know how he doesn't like to wait, right? So let's roll out. To Canada we go. Oh, there you are, sweet baby. Oh, come to Papa. You look so delicious. And you, oh, you smell even better. Oh, my gosh. I love my Canadian bacon. Oh, BLT. Oh, so good. Oh, mm, oh I love Canada. I really need to get stationed here. I'm kind of tired of seeing. Whoa, my gosh. Why did, don't you scare me like that? Oh, my gosh. You what, what are you doing? What? Oh, oh, weapons training today. Right. Oh, my gosh. Where's your helmet? You don't have your eye protection or your helmet on, do you? No, you don't. But don't worry about it. I don't care. We got things to do. Not a lot of time. Let's get rolling. Would you like a bag of chips? So welcome back, everybody. We are here in PEI, Canada, at the Summerside uh, military base. And we are going to do some weapons training, or at least weapons testing, because I haven't done anything with these new weapons. These just arrived via airdrop. Um, on Friday. Yeah, I'm a little bit behind the eight ball here, but uh, we're going to take a look today and see what we have. So I've got four of the new weapons right here on this metal panel, and we have the fifth one. There's actually five new guns, one in that locked locker over there. I'm going to keep that a secret until we're done with these others first. So let's take a look at how about this fella right here. Let's snatch it up, put it in. Well, actually, let's look at the description first. It's a fusillot. A fu 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 fusilaw. Fusilaw. Yeah, this is a, uh, I believe it's called Fussy Lout. Uh, I, I could be wrong. I'm, I, don't, I don't speak French. <laughs> it is a French assault rifle chambered in Ranger ammunition. There's a Ranger magazine in it right now. It's an epic range weapon, and it is based on, let's equip it. It is based on the French real-life weapon of the, uh, the, the FAMAS. Uh, a lot of you guys are probably familiar with that if you play any kind of shooter. And there it is up close. Let's see, it takes uh, barrel attachments, of course, ranger attachments. It'll accept um, tactical attachments as well. Pretty much all of them and grips. But I'm going to shoot it just au natural. And I do believe that's French as well. Au natural, although I will put a difference. Now, let's just leave it as it is. Like I said here, it does take the ranger drum. Let's use the ranger drum, though, because I think we're going to get some company uh, once I start shooting. So we have some targets here. Let's, uh, let's take them down. We have a semi-automatic and a burst fire mode and a safety. Oh, I like a burst. Oh, nice. I like it. Is it three rounds? We're going to find out. Let's get down on one knee and try to get a little accuracy here. And let's shoot that target right there. Three round burst. Oh, nice. I like the sound of it. Here come the friends. Let's shoot another target over there. Three rounds. Oh, it's a spitter. Got him. That's the three round burst right there. Pull the trigger once. And it shoots, fires three rounds, of course. That's why it's called a three round burst. Just to make sure your target's dead. But, although that kind of missed. Oh, here they come. I'm going to switch. No, I'm not. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, wow, man, they're faster than they look. Okay, that's the three round burst. Let's go to single fire. Oh, ah, he scared the dickens out of me. <laughs> not so great at the hip. There he comes. Over here, fella. No, 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 no. Over here. Turn around. This way. Let's do three round burst on the uh, crawler. Yeah, three round burst should kill it. <laughs> Just like so. Bit of recoil there, the three round, obviously. Pretty durable, too. All those shots right there are down to 91%. Not too shabby. Again, I don't know all the specifics of these weapons, guys. I'm just going to run through them real quick, one at a time. I haven't really had a lot of time to mess around with these off camera. So, like I said, this is kind of a test drive, really. We have an Agve. Agvir, as I think that's how you say it. It's an Austrian assault rifle chambered in Ranger ammo. Again, Ranger magazines and also the drum. And it's an epic ranged weapon. 
I'll be the judge of that. And who left their pants here on the floor? <clears throat> Wait a second. Wait, I, I, listen, I know pants are optional back here in the range, but uh, we prefer that you keep them on, if you don't mind. Thank you. <laughs> now look at this AUG. This is the AUG. The, the Steyr AUG is what the real world counterpart is. At least that's what I think. Uh, it comes with its own scope. Check that out. Looks like maybe a four power. Oh, I like it. All right, well, let's see. Let's shoot it. I'm going to hold my breath here and try to get a nice single shot. What does this have, by the way? Oh, that was auto. Oh, over here, feller. Smile. Ooh, I like this. Single fire. I'm going to put it on auto. And I can get a single fire with an auto. No kidding. Ooh, so it's got a slower fire rate, apparently. With some of the automatics, it's hard to get a single shot out of an auto. But this one seems to work pretty well. Here, now we're going to shoot auto. Oh, wow, that's really slow. Anybody else? We need some more volunteers. Oh, here's one. Let's go get him. It's pretty slow. Automatic. Good damage, though. And low, low recoil. Like almost zero. I don't even have a grip on it. Does it come with its own grip? No. <laughs> Very, very, very nice low recoil. I kind of like this weapon. Hello? Who that? All right, let's put that away. Thank you very much for your services. You've performed admirably. And look at that. All the, well, I think I shot 34 rounds, and it only dropped 7%. Again, because it's a ranger weapon, and ranger weapons typically have more durability than the military and the civilian's uh, counterparts. So, very cool stuff indeed. And I think I'm gonna need some more ammunition. Let's grab a couple of drums. Put that drum in there, there we go. Listen, I've got unlimited resources here as part of the military, don't worry about it. And now we have a Night Raider. It's an epic ranged weapon. It's a German assault rifle chambered in Ranger ammo. Um, again, we'll take the drum or the 35 round magazine. Let's equip it. This is modeled after the uh, HK G36. Pretty sure that's what everyone's saying. Oh, man, you know what? We need more volunteers and more targets. So, yeah, as I usually do, let me make a phone call. Uh, hang on one sec. <clears throat> yeah, um, Washington, this is uh, Sergeant Smack down here, up here in Canada, rather. Could you uh, send us some more volunteers? I'm kind of out. Yeah, yeah, the usual. Yeah, yep, the drooling and crawling and bitey kind. Yeah, send lots. Uh, I'll be waiting. Okay, thanks. <clears throat> now, a lot of people wonder why I'm calling from Canada to Washington. Well, this operation is run by the U.S. military. I'm with the U.S. military. But anyway, let's just wait. Do I have any more food? Uh, oops, nope. Just my, my, just my pearly colt, sadly. All right, well, uh, smoke them while you got them, buddy. <clears throat> we'll just wait. Yikes, look out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch it! Watch out! Watch it! We have a volunteer here that literally landed right out of the sky on our heads. Yeah, these guys in Washington. You think you're funny? I said drop off some volunteers. I didn't mean right on top of us. Anyway, let's get a little space here. Let's try out this gun. We have an automatic fire, a safety, and a semi. Let's try the automatic. Stand down, soldier! We're not ready! All right, fight! There we go. Hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> and here they come. Oh, gosh. <laughs> let's keep it on auto. Let's see how... Whoa, man. Spitters and blowers and uh, exploders and, and, and everything else that I can think of. Uh, anyway, let's take a breather here. So this is the Night Raider. It takes all the attachments. Uh, Ranger attachments, that is. And by the way, the AUG takes all the attachments, too. I don't think I pointed that out, but it does, just like this one. Um, let's put a Ranger drum in there, and now we can go mess around. Let's get back into the range, in fact. Let's try semi-auto. I'm going to get down on one knee. And let's put in a... Uh, let's put in a cross scope. Let's see how accurate this puppy is. And how much recoil. Oh, very low recoil. I like it. Let me get my breath back. Single fire, obviously. Now let's go to auto magical fire. And oh, look who's late to the party. Over here, feller. Smile. Oh, did he knock... Did he knock that... Really? He went right to the last place he heard a sound. <laughs> well, this is the last sound you'll ever hear. Put a bullet in his ear. All right, let's try automatic. 
Hmm. Nice. Very steady. Very steady indeed. I want to try automatic on a zombie, though. Let's go try out these volunteers over here. All right, let's get down. Let's get down to Boogie, fellas. This is automatic. It's much faster than the AUG, isn't it? Shoot from the hip. Shoot from the hip. Okay. A couple of headshots. And there's dead. All right, let's put this away. It's kind of fun and all, but we want to take a look at some of the other ones. And the last one we have on the wall here is a sniper rifle, looks like. It's an Echo. It's a legendary range weapon. I think the others so far all have been epic. Takes an Echo magazine. Hmm, that's different. And it holds seven rounds. Russian sniper rifle chambered in Echo ammunition. My guess is it takes um, high caliber Ranger ammo. Do I have any on me? I'm pretty sure. Yes, I do. Of course I do. All right, let's go try this. Oh, we're going to need more volunteers, dagnabbit. So let me make the call. But this time I'm going to be prepared. HQ, it's Sergeant Smack. I'm here in PEI. I'm going to need some more volunteers. And please don't drop them on my head. That's not funny. I'm not laughing. Nobody here is laughing, all right? Just drop them nearby. Thank you very much. We'll be waiting. <clears throat> okay. Oh, oh, you put your pants on again. Thanks. <laughs> oh, no, you didn't. Uh, I. What did I just say? That's not funny. All right, anyway, well, I had my Vanya prepared, so <laughs> no problem. And now here they come. Oh, wait a minute, guys. No, I don't want to use the Vanya. Oh, crap. Okay. Let's, let's drop the Vanya. We'll swap it out with this uh, sniper rifle. And let's put an actual scope on here. Oh, somebody's coming. Hi. Stop. Whoa. That thing is super loud. Oh, it's a bolt action. Holy mackerel, I love the sound of this thing. It's amazing. Let's put a six power scope, oh, I'm sorry, seven power scope on here. And let's shoot this fella incoming. It's a crawly crawler. Really? Not even a one shot to the head? I mean, it sounds like it could poke a hole in a tank and maybe it can, I don't know. All right, let's shoot from over here. And one headshot there. Oh yeah, it's one headshot in that case. Stand her up. Wow, does it do some serious damage? Do oh, <laughs> I have no secondary weapon. Ow! Oh, grab my coat. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Ow! Oh, he got me again. This is what happens when you're not prepared. I'm ill prepared for this. Really? Mm -hmm. That's right. You better lose your shirt. I'm not serving lunch. Get out of here. Oh, Dread, here comes the rain. Look at this turkey. We're not serving lunch. Get out of here. I don't care what this guy said. Let's take him out with a sniper rifle. Now this does not have great durability. 79%, wow. Yeah, that dropped considerably, didn't it? But it's got an amazing sound. Let's just sit here and wait the rain out, okay? It's about the only umbrella in the whole place. Um, <clears throat> you wanna check on this guy? I think he's in shock. Yeah, just check his pulse, would you? Yeah, anything? Nah, I didn't think so. Oh well. All right, the raid stopped. You can put your pants back on now, okay? I'm gonna go grab the last gun, and then uh, we're gonna finish this demonstration up. Don't, don't you peek. This is a super surprise. I, I know you're peeking. I can feel your eyes in the back of my head. You turn around. I saw that. Just let me get the gun. I'll be right over. Put those pants on. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, hey, 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 hey. Okay, you can turn around now. <laughs> Check it out. Say hello to my little friend, cockroaches. <laughs> All right, come on, let's go do something. Grab my, hop on my back. <laughs> Grab on my back. Uh, oh, we need volunteers, and I want a big one. I want a big one. Hang on one sec. Let's get some volunteers in here. <clears throat> hey, uh, Washington, it's me again. Send some volunteers. Send the big guy, the, the mega. Yeah, the real big dude. You know him, right? Yeah. Yeah, the shirtless man. Send him. Make sure he has pants on, though. We have one guy running around over here without pants. We don't need two. Thanks. Bye. Click. Ah, oh, Jason. Oh, they did it to me again. That's, that's three. That's, that's just twice. That's two times. Two times in a row. Drat. All right, let's get the minigun out. <laughs> so this is the minigun. It is a ranger weapon. Oh, there's the big guy. Good, they got my order proper this time. They don't usually get the order right. Uh, okay, here they come. Here they come. I kind of want... Oh, you know what? Fine. You guys want to do that over there? That's good. I Because I really want to test this on the big guy. Actually, let's, let's lay waste to all these fellas first. Go on. You know where the sound is. I don't want him to see me. I'm just going to go right to the last time you heard a sound. Right on over there. There you go. Keep going. Oh, sun's going down. Let's get them all together. 
And <laughs> look at them all. <laughs> They're all surrounding their buddy. The old volunteer that I took down. Yeah, I sorry guys, but he tried to bite me. Keep right okay, ready? And spinning it up and that's right click and then fire. Oh my gosh. It's a Hell's Fury legendary rage weapon. And my gosh, it went down to 74% just from shooting those rounds. 75 rounds. Wow. Russian minigun chambered in Hell's Fury ammunition. <gasps> I love it. Let's go test it against the big guy. And by the way, Ranger ammo, right? So this takes, um, it actually takes low caliber Ranger ammo. Let's test that right now. It does. It takes a low cal. Oh, that's good. It's a good thing because, man, it burns through ammo so fast. All right, let's go get this guy before the sun goes down, the big guy. Uh, I should repair it, though. Oh, I should reload, too. Let's take a look at it. Let me heft it up here. My gosh, it's so heavy. Uh, let's put a flashlight on it. No barrel attachments. Just a tactical. You can't even put a sight on it. <laughs> okay. Now, I need some metal in order to fix this thing before we do anything. So, oh boy. Yeah. Uh, sorry, car. Look at this, it does damage to, to uh, metal. Yeah, over there, fella. It does damage to armored vehicles. I think the Jeep is an armored vehicle. This thing damages pretty much everything, according to the wiki. I did look it up. Now, let me grab some metal here. I think you need eight total to fix it. So it's, yeah, it, it breaks down really quickly and easily, and it's super expensive to repair. Um, but let me, uh, let me see if I have enough metal here. I should. Somebody coming? No. All right, stand back. Let me fix this up. Yeah, okay, looks good. Now. <laughs> so, yeah, it does take, uh, let's see, eight metal to fix. There we go. And look at the size of this thing. It's the biggest gun in the game. Three by five. Won't even fit on a rack. That's why I had to put it in the locker. Now, let's give, oh, I think 215 rounds ought to be enough to kill one little tank. What do you say? But he does have friends. Okay, so yeah, I've combined the two drums into one, so 250 rounds. That's the largest ammunition drum in the game. Now, let's get his attention. Oh, not with that. I'm gonna bring him out over here in the light. Here. Come to Papa! Woohoo! Oh wait, I'm not Papa. Come, come to Smack. Alright, let's lay down the law. Say hello to my little friend! Spin it up! Oh, yeah, baby! Oh, I love it! You cockroaches! Anybody else? Whoa, yeah! Okay, there we go. Oh, look at the casings fly. Oh, this thing's amazing. Uh, don't you dare say a word about this Jeep to anyone, you got me? <clears throat> yeah, that was the captain's. Oh, never mind. Evidence is gone. Perfect. All right. With that, my friends, I think we're going to call it quits. I'm going to go play around more with my little minigun here. This is so fun. Hex Fury! Woohoo! Okay. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day! Bye-bye! <laughs>